It really has been surreal. I, when, when it initially happened, the whole process of getting phone calls and uh, um, getting going through the interview process and the, and the, and the thought of coming back here uh, was really exciting. And then getting the job, I, you know, for a few days, end up in the same exact building I was in for uh, just about a little over 10 years before. You know, you almost had to pinch yourself. I end up at the same desk, the same office, you know, and looking over the place and just some of the equipment has changed. Other than that, it was, it was, it was neat to come back to it. This has really been a blessing for me and, and my wife. And I was blessed to work under Dan Dowerpour here. And, you know, I always call him the, the, the beginner, the father of this place because strength and conditioning started with him. And I was blessed to work with him and, and to see his passion that he had for Miami in general and where Miami was going. And I think our process needs to be that way. I, I, my, my goals in a lot of ways, the strength side of it, yes, the, as I call it, the meathead stuff that we do is, is, yeah, that's what I do, but there's a lot more to this. And it's the development of the men and women for a lifetime of winning championships. And we just, we gotta get to that point of them feeling confident that they can go and do that, that they are prepared, they've got themselves ready to do that, and we're gonna go win a championship. And then we strive to do that daily, every day, every day. You know, and I, hopefully for a lifetime they're doing it. You know, my responsibility is for this building and the teams that I have coming through this building. And uh, so my eyes, my ears, my development, everything I do is focused towards what they're, they're doing. And uh, so it has been, I think it's, it's a pivotal role for us. I really think it's something that needed to happen years back. We just weren't in a situation to be able to do it. And basketball notoriously across the board, uh, nature of the sport, the limbs are always longer. So they have to work on a lot of range of motion. I mean, there's a lot of things we're doing right now, just getting some flexibility, getting some movement patterns into it, and get the strength through a longer range of motion. And so we're working on that stuff with the guys a lot. I'm really pushing on them uh, to, to just start putting some work in and get some size to them, get some strength to them. In their conditioning as they practice and do stuff, we'll kind of pick the tempo up in there. Coach has been on them with that. Um, and then I'll start adding on as we get closer to summer stuff, we're going to start adding more to that and, you know, evaluate it from there what we need to do and what he wants to do running wise, how he wants to run his practice. I've got to get the guys to match that tempo now so that they're, we can go at a higher rate once they get into seasons. Women's side of it, they do a pretty good job. They had done a pretty good job in the back pass. Uh, so the girls were, from a fitness standpoint, were pretty decent. You know, we're just going to build on top of it. There's a, there's a new, new way, a new system, and so they've got to learn to it, and uh, the rate's a little higher. Uh, Strength-wise, they're the same way. We've got to get a little more into it, but they're, they're in pretty good shape. We just want to build on top of it and get them, get them set. Uh, Megan, we've been right on it from the get-go. She's, she's fireball, wanting to make sure that we, you know, we're, we're running a certain tempo, a certain mentality, and uh, it, it's been good for the girls. I think they're, they're having to see a different pace that they have to run at, and we've had to carry that over in everything that they do. Uh, that's really her belief, is that we, we carry that championship mentality everywhere. Coach Owens, I've had a little less, but we're getting it because he's just got his staff finished up. And uh, I was able uh, yesterday to go to his uh, uh, practice, his first practice, and got to watch him go and see his tempo. And, I mean, he's all over them to get them in a certain rate and uh, we're, we're going to try to mimic a lot of those things but my primary goal right now is really get the, the kids strong especially for our men's side um, one where we have some older guys but we've got some younger guys in there and we just we got to get some growth we gotta get some size to get into them so that they have something to uh, kind of have some longevity through the season those are things that were instilled in me that love and passion for miami which made it exciting for me to come back here and i'm hoping that we can get on that role of feeling like they, they have a stake in the game, so to speak. That these kids, their life is involved in this. And so uh, I'm really excited about that process. And that's really what I want to see. My goal for them is to get them to that point where they believe daily we have a chance to win this.